Hi, my name is Tom. In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate how to select images for a photo album using the software provided by your photographer. Once the photographer has uploaded your event images, you will receive an email containing the URL of the photographer's gallery. Once you click on that link, you will see a screen similar to this. Please find and click on your event. If your event is password protected, please enter the password. And you can check in your email for the password. At the top here are the two products that the photographer has selected for you to order. You have your main album and your parent album. And they've selected 20 images for each that you can pick. Let's take a look at the left side here. So we have my pictures, which represents all the images that you have to choose from. Favorites are any images that you would like to look at as a possible insert into your products or for a possible product ordering later, such as a print enlargement. Uh, and you can go ahead and do that by clicking on the heart next to any one of these images, and you'll see that it shows up in the favorites tab. So if I click on that, it'll show me all the images that have the Favorites tab assigned to it. I can click back on My Pictures to select all the images and view them all. Lastly, we have our Recommended Images. And right now, we have 20 images per page. I'm going to select 50 images per page because there are 50 images that the photographer has given us to choose from. And out of those 50, there are 20 that the photographer is recommending that we use for our albums. So we can use those as a stepping point or we can look at the whole group. Now we're going to demonstrate how to select images for the two products, the main album and the parent album. And right now we currently have zero images selected for both. So I can click on the main album icon here or the parent album icon here and you see that these two icons here are the same as these two here. And for instance, if I want this image in the main album, I can just click on it and click on this and this. And you'll see that there's now three images in the main album. And likewise, if I want to include this one in the parent album and this one in the parent album and this one, we can use the same image in both albums. And most importantly, if we'd like to see the images a bit larger, if we click on the image, we get a full screen preview, and we still have the same icons at the bottom. So choose the product that you'd like to assign it to, or use the right arrow key to move to the next image, or the left arrow key to move back. And if you want to favorite an image, favorite an image will not assign it to a product but it will put it in a separate category where you can choose whether or not you want to include it with your prints or with your products. So if I'm not sure if it's going to go in either of the two albums, I may want to favorite it and come back to that later. So I'm just going to quickly go ahead and select images that I'd like to see in my main and my parent album. And I now have 20 images in my main album and 20 images in my parent album. And if I want to possibly look at other options, these are the three favorites that I wasn't sure about. I can, for instance, add one of them to my main album, but I've reached the maximum number. So I need to go back to the main album and take one out. So for instance, I'm going to see that these two repeat. So I'm going to turn this off in the main album, go back to my favorites. And now I can add that to the main album. And we now have 20 images in the main and the parent album. Now in my favorite section, I may have a couple of images that I really want to use as an enlargement. For instance, this image, I may want to order as a enlargement print. 
So I can I can click on the message icon and request an enlargement for this particular image outside of my album order. And the photographer will get this message and will forward this to print. Saves a lot of phone calls. This is an event message. If you want to comment to the photographer about the whole job um, or ask a question, and the photographer will see this as well. Once you're happy with your selections for your main album and your parent album and any requests that you've made for enlargements, you can click on I am done selecting images. You're about to select, submit your selected images and once this event is marked as selection completed, you will not be able to make any more changes for this event. The website will send an email to your photographer notifying them about your job completion. Are you sure that you're done selecting all of your images? And I'll confirm at this time. And it now says selection completed. And we can leave this page and the photographer will receive all the selections and send them to print.